All right, I'm gonna do a quick little video with Nero. I have already uh, started to upload one today, but it still hasn't loaded. I don't know what's going on. So uh, today is uh, what, Tuesday? And hopefully these are loaded by tomorrow or Wednesday. So maybe you'll be seeing this on Wednesday. Um, so we're gonna do a little video with Nero and I'm gonna start kind of do a little something different. Uh, show how you can hold, teach your dog to hold an object in its mouth. And we're going to start this off. It's real quick, real simple. Keep it short and sweet. Don't keep drilling it with a dog. Nero, come. Come on, Bubba. Come. Good boy. Good boy. Come on. Come on. Yeah, get up there. Good boy. All right, so first off, this is a good exercise to do to try to help the dog be calm when you're handling it and it's not jumping around, jumping up in your face, and it learns a little self-control at the same time. And we're going to see all of this. Uh-uh. Sit. Sit. Good. All right. So we're going to start doing how to teach the hold command with some, holding something in its mouth. So first I just want to kind of get the dog to start calming down, patting his head a little bit, holding his face, Shh. barely holding his face, just kind of resting his face in my hand, but also kind of restraining him a little bit. Just getting used to that feeling. Nope. Shh. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my thumb and we're going to put it in his mouth, right behind the canines, the front and the back. Good. And we're just going to hold it there. Hold. And as soon as he stops, good. As soon as he stops moving and quits going with his tongue or biting down on my thumb, I'm going to take it out and say good. Good. Now I'm not saying the, the command yet, I'm just getting him used to having something in his mouth. Good. And he can't just spit it out. And a lot of times that really freaks the dog out when they can't spit it out right away. But the reason I use my thumb with the smaller dogs is because I can kind of hold their mouth and I can make sure their gums and everything are their lips are out of the way of their teeth. Good. But I want him to hold his head up a little. Good. Uh-huh. Good. Good boy. Good boy. That's a good boy. So we're only going to do this about five times because they get a little tired of it real quick and I don't blame them. But you want to make sure the tongue and the lips are good. Hold. Good. Okay. Good. I'm going to do it one more time. Good boy. Good boy. Sit. So for this, you kind of do have to restrain them a little bit. A lot of guys will put a hold. Good. A lot of guys will put like a, a line with a little pulley and a, a tether about yay longer to keep the dogs up on the table, but I just hold them, hold them with my hand in the mouth. So what that's going to do, and you're gonna see it kind of form pretty quickly, He'll start, re he'll start relating hold with holding my thumb in his mouth. You see, my thumb's a little red there just from his teeth grinding on it. I'll start holding my thumb in his mouth just a little bit. And then we can start putting another object. And at the same time, I'm going to teach him to come to heel. And we're going to put it all together as a retrieve. And it's probably the best thing you can teach a dog how to do, honestly. Nero. And this is how you teach him. This is how I teach every dog to come to heel. Nero, come. I'm just going to lure again. 
Boom. If he comes to my left hand side, he's gonna get rewarded. Come past me, turn around, and I'm gonna reward him. Nero, come. So it's a little sloppy right now. He's still kind of catching on to the game, but eventually that will, we will have him, I will be able to have him at a heel, tell him to hold. He can go pick up an object and bring it back to me, come to heel and release it in my hand. He is a thirsty dog right now. So quick little video on how we're gonna get going on that. It's pretty fun. And uh, I think a lot of people can kind of follow, do something that people can kind of follow along with their dog. Do something a little bit different. Um, but other than that, he's an awesome dog. He's a lot of fun. All right, toodles.